All right, and two uptick teams. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Roger Ayers, Courtney Green, and Paul Zelk. Nice. Very good action. Action they worked on during the day. To refuse the pick, nice follow-up. That's exactly what Georgia Tech has got to be able to do. Get on the glass. Well, if there's one thing we're going to see tonight, Aria, it's going to be pocket passes on the break. Great drive. Great throw ahead off the break. Tay Davis into the scoring column. And the Irish on the board. Notre Dame 8-16 on the year. Snapped a seven-game losing streak with the win over Virginia Tech Saturday right here at first set. Strong drive to the basket. How about Reeves? They want to get him going. Not great spacing on this break. Now they're trying to get it better. But usually this team does a great job of getting to the corner. But a great pull up. Most complete game against Virginia Tech Saturday. 16 points, 8 assists. Got his teammates involved, the floor general, and got 6 steals on defense. Well, the steals are incredible. Another great pocket pass. Down great four, pass. Dungo. Corner nice. three, knocked down there by Ibrahim Asako. Roper out of Detroit, Michigan. Northwestern transfer on the stick back. Nice work. I mean, not, not alone. I mean, he can't do it by himself. I mean, they, they've got enough guys that have played enough basketball to have a collective effort. They've got to pick up their communication and their defense. What a slip. He has been a bright spot already. See, that's where you want to be ready to shoot the ball, Ari. If you're Julian Roper, be ready to shoot the ball. They found something out of nothing. That's a great drive by Himes. The Irish last in the ACC in conference play. In offensive efficiency, but second in defense. Oh, three ball Murphy. Corner pocket buries it. That's what he can do. Open three. Davis launches. The break is open here tonight. <laughs> Yeah, good for him. Shrewsbury, he can really shoot it. Yeah, he's not getting any space. He's gotten so much better at that sidestep getting space. He'll get free. There's the one right there. Pops and knocks it down from beyond the arc. Braden Shrews. To not pick and choose when they turn it on. And said, if your teammates, you see them slacking, it's up to you to be able to hold them accountable because we've beaten the best teams in the country, right? Carolina, Duke, Clemson. We've knocked them off, but then we have some of these losses that are head scratching. Well, and, and that's part of it. I mean, but he's got Miles Kelly, who's now got to show more leadership. Nathan George, I think, is going to be a fine leader because you can follow his lead in the way that he plays, and he delivers the ball. How about Burton there? Nice. In a row. Yeah, how about Burton to the rack? Marcus Burton, he's fast, he's quick, he's strong, and he can take contact. That's a heck of an N1. Now, Arya, next foul puts Notre Dame in the bonus. It is important that they find a way to get in that bonus and separate in this game. Kanazny splashes the triple home. Great three, they do such a great job. Both teams do of utilizing the corner. But again, Marcus Parton with an outstanding on time on target pass. 11-0 run for Georgia Tech, for Notre Dame is snapped by Georgia Tech. There's that guy again, oh, Kwasi yeah. Reeves. Corner three and another corner three with the answer. Kwasi Reeves gets up on his jump shot, a very pure shooter. They call him Wasey. Around these parts says Burton. Oh, gravity pulled it through. He's got six points now, 394 on the season. The seventh in the season for a freshman. Jumper, nice. That was Dongo. Under two here in the first half. Kick to the corner. Passing up the three with Sako. Beautiful play. Count it. And one. All right, it's uphill action. All right, to a handoff, to a pocket pass in the middle, to a lob drop off on the bottom. He's had some big moments already early in his career, right? Layup over Armando Baycott. Oh, yeah. Win game winner. Game. Absolutely. How about the shots he hit at Little John in overtime? No question. I just love high pass. Look at the shot. Bingo. You got it right on cue. Nathan George with the rock. Now Kelly. Aggressive early, high yeah. off the glass. First possession. Ball rotation. Reeves. Poked away, stays with the Jackets. He rips it in there in a flush from Kowasi Reeves. Congo is, is good in this area. Hunts it, gets on the floor, knocks it down. Kelly picks it up, throws it. His length, it does not matter how long you are. It matters, do you show your length? Nice pass, count it, and the foul. On a time, getting that pocket pass in the middle of the floor with a corner cutter. Eighth O board for the Irish here at home. Burton. 
Jones with the second chance. Gets the friendly bounce. He's in a double figure. That is beautiful. Low energy spurt from the freshman. The hometown kid, Shrewsbury. Another chance. Left it short. A couple of good looks. Yeah, very much so. You're not, you're not upset with that. He was ready to shoot it. Got to hold his follow through. There it is again. Oh, baby! Dongo! There's Sacco in the flush. They're right now. Georgia Tech knew they had it. They found it. The ball gets to the middle. All right, and it gets dropped off to the corner for a man cutting for a layup. Pass to the high post. Here comes Burton. Up, oh, they go to Davis. All the way to the right. Oh, oh, man. Play. Great play. Great play call. George and the Jackets down three. Slips it inside. Quick little layup Beautiful thrown play. in. And they're going to give it to him. George catches. He's got to throw it up. Mid-court heave. Oh, he almost got it. And no 